Shout out to uh, Buckingham Chrysler. Uh, always arrive in style. Très, très bon service. Pas bonne personne. Fait que Buckingham Chrysler, Buckingham Hyundai. Comme un star officiel de Team Patnaud et de Ludwig Ketwee. Punching the tires. Good for the hands. Elbows, knees, even kicks. So this is a really good punching bag. There's angles too, too, for uppercuts and upward elbows. And it's just a good cardio nice. training nice. out in the nice. sun. Nice. 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 So we have the, the core bar here. It's fucking burning because it's uh, it's in the sun all day. It's core good too. Let's smash it to get all that, that core. Feeling strong, feeling sharp, feeling <laughs> angry and hungry. Hungry for the belt and angry and mean and ready to win. So, right? Nobody's going to give you the belt, you got to go and get it. Right? Yeah. He wants it, you want it, so there's only one belt. So, it's coming, it's it's coming here. So, very good. Ah! Excellent job. Good job. Excellent. Good job. That's how we do it. Let me start. Let's do this. <sighs> All right, so we're about to do some bad sessions with the king. Just putting some finishing touches, big elbows, big headbutts, and let's make fucking history. Right now, <laughs> it's showtime. I feel the pressure, I feel the excitement. It's arriving soon. I live for that feeling, it's the best feeling in the world. You, you, you know that one guy is training to beat you. You know, one guy is training to, he wants to hurt you. And uh, that wakes up the uh, animal instinct that we all have. And uh, a lot of men don't have anymore. And uh, it's like, yeah, it's, it's life. It's real, at least it's, it's my life. Shirt off. Shit's about to get real. Let me take the shirt off. Hard work. Feels amazing. Feels amazing to turn home with the boys. Gonna get that strap. You know what they said, huh? The, it's worth the, the the WLC belt is worth like uh, twenty thousand dollars. So, give me those jewels and golds around my waist. I'm gonna bet some money. Put your money on Dave. I'm telling you. I feel amazing. Just did a couple explosive rounds and uh, people can expect uh, explosions August 2nd. Sati strong, you know, taller, heavier than me and uh, more experienced than me. But uh, it's gonna be a pleasure to welcome him in the uh, Litwe universe. 
took him in, you know, with this fucking bull, tough motherfucker, and he, he, uh, he went down with my headbutts. If Tuntumin had a hard time and fell down the first round on the temple, I don't think uh, Seth's gonna survive it, so I just need to line one. A lot of history. Yeah. Got lots of room, so <laughs> we need some more. Look at this guy here. Look at this guy. You know this guy? <laughs> so that's a uh, long time ago. Yeah, a few years back. So. Uh, that's the, the lightweight championship from Japan, and we also made a little, uh, you know, we're proud of Dave and his accomplishments, so we did the, some replicas of the Myanmar World Championship lightweight belt and the Air KBZ uh, belt as well. His prison fight gloves, because Dave was the first uh, Quebecer and Canadian to fight at the uh, controversial prison fight and win his fight as well, so I got the gloves uh, boxed up, so we did a little... Uh, a little display of uh, Dave's accomplishments, and like I said, yeah, <laughs> we were a lot of money. I would say it's easier to become champion than to stay champ because, you know, all the the challengers, the guys, they come in with nothing to lose, like literally nothing to lose. Either they 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 beat you, they become champ, or they remain in the same spot. So uh, uh, there's a lot of additional pressure when you're a champion, and uh, you have you know all your, you know, for me, I have all my adoptive country, uh, Myanmar, my home country, Canada, that everybody counts on me. All the fight fans around the world, all the all the Litwi fans that, that uh, count on me to protect the throne. So uh, I'm ready, I won't disappoint. And uh, yeah, I, I actually feed off that pressure from being champ and I want to remain and I will remain. Hey guys, we just arrived at the baseball park in Gatineau, Quebec, my hometown. And uh, I'm very excited and very honored because uh, I got invited to do the opening baseball throw. And a lot of people don't know, but 10 years ago, before doing martial art, I was playing baseball and I threw um, a no-hitter right here. So I'm very excited. It's a very uh, cool moment for me. I'm going to do a strike. I'm going to throw a good, a good pitch. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so uh, the Tyrants are a local team here in Gatineau and uh, we're going to support them tonight. I love you. Irina Kerryova <laughs> Irina, tu peux me prendre dans Tu peux me prendre dans C'est ça exactement Alors on veut une prise C'est une prise Une bonne minute de pour toi all right, so we did the throw. It was a bit low, but I'm happy because it's been like 10 years I didn't throw a baseball. So uh, we did it and uh, they were so kind, give us flowers and uh, thank you for the warm welcome. If you're ever in Gatineau, you can see the Tyrants and uh, next time I see you guys, bring back the belt. So uh, we're leaving tomorrow for Myanmar. Let's do this. World Lightweight Championship's biggest event in history. Two world titles are on the line. Cruiserweight World Lightweight Championship, Le Duke versus Bozinski, WLC, King of Nine Limbs.